Welcome to the Gospel of Luke. We're at Luke chapter 12 today, a long stretch, verse 41 to 48. Let's read right at it here. 41 to 48. Then Peter said to him, Lord, do you speak this parable only to us or to all people? And the Lord said, Who then is that faithful and wise steward whom his master will make ruler over his household to give them their portion of food in due season? Blessed is that servant whom his master will find so doing when he comes. Truly I say to you that he will make him ruler over all that he has. But... If that servant says in his heart, my master is delaying his coming and begins to beat the male and female servants and to eat and drink and be drunk, the master of that servant will come on a day when he is not looking for him and at an hour when he is not aware and will cut him in two and appoint him his portion with the unbelievers. And that servant who knew his master's will and did not prepare himself or do according to his will shall be beaten with many stripes but he who did not know yet committed things deserving of stripes shall be beaten with few. For every one to whom much is given, from him much will be required. And to whom much has been committed, of him they will ask the more. So here is a word of responsibility. Much has been given to you and I. Much has been given. Just imagine if you had only been given one book of the New Testament, much would have been given to you. You've been given all the books in the New Testament. You've been given all the books in the Bible. Maybe, you know, God has given us enormous insight into what, what has been, what is, and what will be, into our nature, into the needs we have spiritually. And so God has given us so many things that we so need. And guess what? We have been, much much has been given. It's just just the facts and much will be required of us. But we shouldn't worry about it. What we should do is trust in Jesus and just go forward to the next thing. Let's keep growing in him, and we will be fine. But uh, there's a firm line here. If you behave like the unbeliever behaves, you're going to receive the same outcome as the unbeliever. It's right there in the text. So there's a warning from Jesus. Let's pray. Father in heaven, you have given us so much. Oh, Lord, there's a powerful warning here for us to come up to the line. You're not trying to stress us out or make us all nervous, but Lord, help us to come, come along and keep growing and keep growing as the disciples of Jesus. We ask this in Jesus' name. Amen. Friend, keep growing as a follower of Christ. May his blessings be with you through this day.